Hey guys, I thought I'd make a video out there so everyone could see uh, my whole DVD collection and movie memorabilia collection. Uh, so that's what uh, this video is all about. Uh, I own almost 1100, so I'm not going to go through every single one of them, but let's start over here. Right here I got my Blu-rays, which I've done a video for already. Uh, I have gotten rid of uh, two of them since I did the uh, the video. Then I've just recently redone my collection, so they're in kind of a genre. So here we have comedy. More comedy down there. Comedy continues up here. And then right there is where horror starts. And then we got drama starting right there. And then right there is where animation starts. And then animation continues over here. Musicals. Sci-fi. Uh, remakes. And at the very end, which I can't get to because my bed is in the way is uh, Wes Craven movies. Over here on the bottom of my floor, these are ones I have to make space for, but the one the one on the left is documentaries, followed by Vincent Price films, Jim Carrey films, Adam Sandler films, Stephen King films, Kevin Smith films, uh, Steven Spielberg films, my trauma movies, and then my wrestling DVDs, which I don't have a whole lot of. Over here, we got my Elvis movies. Uh, and then right there are the uh, Universal Monster movies, followed by the Steel Books, which is uh, Live Free Die Hard, Live Free or Die Hard, RoboCop, and Sweeney Todd. Then we have my Godzilla movies. Underneath that, I have all my HD DVDs, followed by my Mac games. And then right here, I have my uh, Scooby Doo DVDs, which I'm a huge fan of Scooby Doo. Um, right here we have some collectibles. <clears throat> I have uh, my Frankenstein Legacy Collection, my Mummy Legacy Collection, the King Kong uh, Collector's thing. It's the uh, two-disc tin of the original movie, and then it comes with uh, Mighty Joe Young and Son of Kong. Got it at Best Buy. Got my uh, Book of the Dead, which is autographed. I forgot to talk about that in the autographed DVDs. I got my Batman Begins um, Limited Edition. And I got some Power Ranger figurines, including one of the original ones still in the packaging. I got a Vincent Price uh, uh, figurine from Edward Scissorhands. Uh, here I have my autographed uh, Shawnee Smith poster. Right there. Next to that I have my Tom Savini autographed picture. And my Sid Haig autographed picture. Here I've got a hand-drawn... Uh, picture of the Wolfman. I got some figurines here from Nightmare Elm Street, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and Friday the 13th. I got a mask, uh, Hot Wheels car, and an Elvis Hot Wheels car. Got some posters back here, including an Asian um, uh, Rambo poster, an X Files poster. I got a Scream 3 poster, Black Christmas, <clears throat> Scream 2 UK poster. Um, right here I have the Fanboys poster, which I actually just got for free yesterday. Um, right here I have my uh, King Creel Elvis uh, poster. And then here I have autographed frame posters, which I haven't hung up anywhere yet. So I got Friday the 13th, which is autographed by Adrian King. Um, right there it's, uh, Betsy Palmer. Uh, I got Tom Savini and Harry Manfredini. And then Ari Lehman, who played Jason at the end of the movie. After that I have, uh, my Nightmare on Elm Street poster, which is autographed by Robert Englund. I have my Scream poster, which is autographed by David Arquette. And my Devil's Rejects poster, which is autographed by Sid Haig. 
and Bill Mosley. And then I have my Jason X poster, which is autographed by Kane Hodder, who played Jason. In the back of my door, I've got uh, the teaser poster for Freddy's Dead, which I bought last year at Weekend of Horrors. I love that poster. Uh, underneath that, I have Nightmare on Elm Street 4. I also have Nightmare on Elm Street 2 and 3. I just have taken those down to make room for these posters. Dark Knight posters. And this one. And there's my dog. What else? Uh, behind the DVD collection here, I have the Stab poster from Scream 2. This one is uh, Seated Chuck, you can't see it. And then I have um, House of a Thousand Corpses right there. Also right here I have kind of a mess, but I have the busts of uh, Wolfman, Frankenstein, and Dracula. I've also got these figurines of different Universal monsters. I also have a Freddy candle. I've got Buzz Cola and Duff uh, Energy Drink, and then back there behind the CDs are uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre shot glasses. Uh, up here, if you've seen my Movie Man 23 movie reviews, you've seen these. These are my Movie Maniacs. Freddy, Jason, uh, Go, uh, Ghostface from Scream, Norman Bates, Chucky, The Fly, uh, Evil Ash from Army of Darkness, Michael Myers, Jason X, and Wishmaster. Got some stuff here. Uh, that right there is actually uh, it's kind of an interesting story. We were trying to make a cover for Gremlins, and somehow or another, I got interfused with a picture from my brother's wedding of me. And we don't know how it looks like that, but I kept it because I thought it was funny. Here we have my complete TV series. We got Alias, the Brady Bunch, Powerpuff Girls, Full House. I Love Lucy, The Cosby Show, behind The Cosby Show is Transformers Generation 1, uh, I got X-Files and The Flintstones, my Rocky poster. Up here we have posters that are upside down, but uh, Halloween Resurrection, we got Red Dragon, uh, Freddy vs. Jason regular poster, Freddy vs. Jason the teaser poster, Back to the Future. Up here, above my door, I have a... Uh, Jason Hot Wheels car, or Matchbox, it's Matchbox. I got the Jason mask, a Freddy Matchbox car, and the glove. I got an autographed Stallone boxing glove, which my aunt gave me at Christmas. Uh, over here we've got the E.T. limited edition box set, uh, an Elvis 3D poster that a friend gave me for my birthday last year, an Elvis uh, glass thing that I got from Graceland, and then I got wine glasses of Freddy and Jason. Uh, right there I got Nightmare on Elm Street lunchbox. I also got uh, 3D posters of Friday the 13th, Nightmare on Elm Street, uh, Exorcist and Wizard of Oz box sets, and then I have, this is a autographed uh, Stan Winston gave me at Wizard World in 2002, and unfortunately he's passed away, so, you know, this is kind of an important thing now. And there I've got some Nightmare on Elm Street uh, posters. And that's pretty much it. So, uh, thanks for joining me on this.